Kiki. What is up, peeps? This is SolarGram2 here, and welcome to my part 11 of Let's Play Pokemon Alpha Sapphire. In the last part, we started to fly over to the Slayport City where the Team Aqua Grunts have stolen the uh, submarine and, and face off to the Grunts in the process. And we have to go to this, uh, fly all the way back to Little Coast City where we face some, some Aqua Grunt in the, uh, in the hideout facing the Aqua Admin and, and of course stolen the sub and of course that Aqua that team Aqua using the submarine to sail all the way up to this or route 128 and we're gonna sail all the way up to Moss Deep Sea where we defeat the 7th gen and also get the uh, heat up dive in the process so in this part we're just gonna go through the uh, route 128 where the where we have to face more of the team Aqua Grunt in this in this uh, city, sea floor cavern, like that. And, and of course, after we're done that, we gotta go sail, sail up and just dive in underwater and just go all the way up to Sutopolis City, and that's where we end the part. That. So, anyways, let's just let's just find out what happens in Route 28. So sometimes I'm curious. And I'm gonna be using the the uh, max repel just to get the wild Pokemon out of the way. And uh, in case if you noticed uh, in the bottom, I actually learned Flash to Latias. In case anyone's noticed, you know, just in case if the room gets darker, we just use the Flash to make it to make it see better. If we, if in in case we uh, if we are approaching a, a massive dark room, so yeah. Anyways, let us go to Route 27, and I'm skipping some of these uh, trainers because I did some of the uh, backtrack. Because you know, I did some of the uh, battling trainers on, in my other episodes or my other parts. So here we go. Use dive. Uh, now I decided to skip some of these uh, trainers just to get a little mix it up a bit. Oh, looks like we get the first time. Seeing the underwater in this game. Ah, oh, there he is. Oh. Yeah, beautiful, nice underwater. Okay, now we're at the seafloor cavern, which of course those aqua grunts have stolen their submarine. And as always, let's just kick some Team Aqua Quant's ass. Good thing I got Lion that has Wax Mask because I'm using him as part of HM Slave. Even though I'm not using him, even though I did use him in rare cases, it's just, I don't know. And we got the uh, Sand Soft after we broke that Wax Mask. Just use Strength to push that boulder into that hole. You want face me now. Time to get your ass kicked. Team Aqua Grunt. This is probably the last time we're going to be seeing some of these uh, Team Aqua Grunts. Once we're done with this uh, sea block cabin, we're not going to be able to see those Team Aqua Grunts anymore. So, yeah. Lumbo, you get a level up to 44, and just learn Hydro Pump. So, I'm that, that's a really good move. So, I'm gonna get rid of Bubble Beam. Sorry, Bubble Beam, but you're no use anymore. Bye bye, Bubble Beam, and hello, Hydro Pump. It's nice. Let's go to send on his Mighty Anna with that not intimidate, and just go for Exorza. Slash. Takes down the Mighty Anna with one Exorza sweep. Latias gets a level up to 40. Hmm. 
Well, go home then. Go home, you lazy grunt. If you don't want to work for Team Aqua anymore, just go home. So there. Yep, the old usual path with in the like in the original will be in Sapphire. But it looks like I'm gonna have to take this path. And I'm gonna have to take this path. Okay. Push this boulder. Okay. Okay. You, you grunt, face me. Because you are a bad guy. Because you are. Like in the original, we'll be in Sapphire. So yeah, and Emerald, of course. You gotta send her your money, and uh, you gotta pick up that Intimidate, of course. Sometimes some of these grunts carrying an 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 imitate mighty Mar and some of those grunts that have mighty doesn't that does not have an Intimidate. Po probably it's just I don't know. They have a secondary ability. I don't know. It's just I don't know. This is what it is. A pick X is a slash, so make a subtile. Pelabur gets a level up to 43. Send out Mark. But I'm gonna be sending it to Metagross. To do the work from there. Go Metagross! Sunny Metagross. Use your Zen headbutt. Boom. Takes down the mark. You give me your money now. Thank you very much. Hmm. This this puzzle is different now. Looks like this puzzle is completely different. Looks like we get the another easy one, I think. Because I can think. Because I think you gotta push these uh, two boulders. Looks like this puzzle is slightly new. I think. But I think. I think. Ah, screw it over. Start over. Ah, looks like this puzzle's gonna be uh, different. Now do you drink again? Another repel. Ah. I have to put the, put this boulder. Ah. Ah. Now then I can squeeze past here. There you go. That wasn't so hard. It's just it's gonna practice because it's been a while. Looks like we are getting close to Kyoga. And of course we're gonna face Archie in the process. So yeah. Ooh, get the TM26, which contains Earthquake. Very, very good move to have. It's very, very good TM to have. So let's just go down to this big hall. There's Maxine and Archie. And, I'm, and looks like Maxi got his ass kicked by Archie. Hmm. 
Hey, break it up, you two. Break it up. No need to go fighting over it. L looks like Ma Maxine just somehow bows to Artsy. It's like, I am your master. Say, yes, Master Artsy. You beat me once before. Ugh. So I have no choice but to slave you. <laughs> it's just... I don't know, it's like Maxine somehow bows to him. It's just... yeah. There's Kyogre sleeping. I'm all Kyogre. Hmm. Okay, we get to face RT for the second time. And this time, when we're facing Sarpedo, it's going to make Evolve. Because I can tell by the anchor necklace. Wow. Nice blue battling background effect. It's like we're in a swirling, bluey, watery vortex kind of thing. It's like, wow. It's like it's so beautiful. It's like. It's like this background is so intense. It's like. I don't know. It's 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 just feel intense. You know what I mean. So yeah. Next is all. Take that mighty Anna down. Cause it's weak. Muck. I'm gonna send out my metal gloves to to do the work. Big mistake, cause Metal Ghost is still in Psychic. And it's gonna send out the so that fucking Sarpedo. No, no, or, or Crobat. You just made the biggest mistake ever, Archie. You know that. You made one of the biggest mistakes you have ever did. Switching in, into another poison type Pokemon, that's Crobat. It's like... That is a wrong move, Artsy. That is not a switching. That is definitely not a switching, Artsy. You just fucked it up big time. Uh. Nah. I'm, I'm gonna keep medical sin. I'm gonna keep medical sin because it's gonna send out muck again. Hopefully, it doesn't switch it to so to sarpedo. Th there you go. It's just, I cannot believe that Artsy made, just, just put a non-switching move. That's, that's just, that's just a, that's just the biggest Batata move I've ever seen from, from Artsy. Just switching into another Pokemon while being attacked by Zen Hedabar. That's just the Batata move I've ever seen from Artsy. It's got a Sarpedo, which of course is gonna make it evolve into Mega Sarpedo. And here it comes Mega Sarpedo. Leaf Blade takes down the Mega Sarpedo. Leader Arts, Aqua Leader Arts has been defeated once again. 
because you made a made the biggest retarded move I ever seen. So yeah. Why are you so laughing about it? You lost. Face it. Yeah, you gotta use the blue orb and not the red orb like in the older ones. In the original will be in Sapphire and Emerald. Well, what does Team Aqua Admin have to say about that now? And he's gonna use the power of the blue orb to awaken in Kyogre's power. And he's gonna. Well, eventually, gonna use it to primary evolve it. But wait! It's going to disappear again. It's going to make Kyoka disappear like in the original, like in the original game. Let's just find out and see. Yeah, it's gonna use the blue orb. So I figured. Oh my god, it's Kyoka. Finally awoken from its internal slumber. And it's going to disappear. Sink. But oh, wait, not quite. It's got a primary evolve it. Gotta just gotta use a fucking drizzle. Uh, it's gotta cost havoc around Hoenn. Well, glad the Archie just used the white item for once instead of using the red orb, causing them to disappear. Yeah, it's gonna cause major heavy rain around our home, and it's gonna it's gonna make it into a planet water. Sometimes I will talk in some of these parts, and sometimes I won't. It's just sometimes it depends on me, you know. It, it, sometimes it just depends who I am and such. So yeah. So, so if you want to read the text and stuff, in case if I just, you know, you you can just pause it and read the text if you want to.
Okay, so therefore Artsy did the wrong thing after all. It's just... I don't know, I'm just making sometimes my own thoughts up, that's all. It's just I have no idea. Like, I don't know. In the older what games, he just used the red orb, but in this one, he used the blue blue orb. It still caused the same problem. So I don't know why. Anyways, that's just my own thoughts. Yeah. Yeah. So top of the that's where we're in the part here. And Steven's gonna fly and meet us. Come on now, there's Steven. He's gonna talk to us about that crazy half going on outside. It's like pouring every rain outside. Sometimes, like in the in the days and days, I feel like the same way having having heavy rain outside in my end. It's just, it's just sometimes it happens in life. But sometimes we get sunny days and sometimes we get heavy rains. So that's it. We're going to Sutopolis City and head over to the Cave of Origins, where we get to where we where we get to see Primal Kyoka. But that will be in the next part, and I'm afraid. So we have to you have to stay tuned for that. Well, Sutopolis always has the answer. It's in the Cave of Origins. And that being said, let's just head over. To, let's just try to uh, head over to Su Su Sutopolis City. <coughs> Sorry about that. Just got the cough. Dive in underwater at, at this part of a uh, dark blue sea. Go, go into this this little cave under there, and we're going to dive dive right back up out this water, and we arrived at Sutopolis City. Yeah, yeah, I know that's the top of the city. Going to the Pokemon Center. You know, since that we are at the Sutopolis City. I'm going to healing up my Pokemon. I'm going to save my game. 
And I'm going to have to end this part 11 here. Anyways, it's the Sonic M2 doing this part 11 of Pokemon Alpha Sapphire. And I'll be seeing you guys later in part 12. Where we... Where we are going to, and going to see the Primal Kyogre in the Cave of Origins. And hopefully, if it's going to be a sort of one, if I've attempted to catch Primal Kyogre, we are going to be going to do a facing the 8th gym leader, and that is Wallace. So, anyways, this is Sonic M2, signing out.